Hello guys, this is Chippy TV and welcome to my YouTube channel. And for today's video guys, ay tuturo ko sa inyo kung paano mag-fill up ng US tax information sa AdSense. So, unang gawin nyo guys is pumunta po kayo dun sa inyo AdSense. Ah, uh, yung nakikita nyo po ngayon. Then, ah, uh, Pag nakapunta na kayo doon, hanapin nyo na lang po yung uh, payments. Ayan. Pagdating sa payments, or hindi na po kayo kailangan pumunta lang ito, pumunta lang po kayo doon sa manage, tax, and info. Then, pagbukas nyo ng manage, tax, and info, ayan, makikita nyo agad yung ah, uh, to get the outs from Google, make sure to provide tax information. This will take a few minutes. Ayan, makikita nyo po yung kulay blue. Add tax. And po. Then, pasok lang tayo doon. Then, ayan. Uh, password. Ayan, yung Gmail nyo sa AdSense. Then, next nyo lang. Then, after nyan, guys, ayan, uh, lalabas na agad yung, ano, ayan, what type of account is yung channel ninyo, guys. Connect na siya, di ba? So, piliin nyo lang individual. Then, next nyo lang. Then, are you a citizen of, of United States? Sabihin nyo lang, no. Then, yung makikita nyo po yung dalawang form, guys. Yung unang form is most commonly used by non-US individuals and would also be used to claim tax treaty benefits na yan. So, yung pangalawang form is commonly used by a non-US business entity or individual that earns income related to US trade or business and fly, uh, fly, files, uh, files a US income tax report ayan then syempre ah uh, uh, ko pipiliin po natin yung w-8ben then uh, enter lang natin ulit next then ayan na guys lalabas siya po syempre yung pangalan mo name of individual then country of citizenship piliin mo lang Philippines ah uh, yan guys ko dito sa tax fair identification number dito po ah uh, importante po yan guys kung saan po naka-address yung uh, adsense ninyo dapat doon din po kayo kumuha ng inyong tax number so since dito po ako nakabase sa New Zealand so yung gamit ko po ay New Zealand kung ikaw naman po ay nakabase sa Pilipinas syempre gamitin mo yung TIN number natin sa Pilipinas so 128-605-567 next mo lang then matik na yan so yung permanent residence address guys ay click mo lang yan then lalabas na yung address mo dyan then sa baba nyan click mo lang ulit yung mailing address at saka yung permanent address same lang naman then uh, ayan na so next lang next lang ulit guys so are you claiming a reduced rate of withholding under tax treaty ayan so yes mo lang yun yun guys yes so since uh, nasa New Zealand ako or kung nasa Pilipinas ka so yes mo lang yan then residents of country claiming treaty with the US so 
yung mga bansa na nandito guys yun po ay may treaty sa US about sa tax so kung wala yung bansa nyo dyan so hindi po siya kasali so hinanap ko po yung New Zealand ayan kasali po siya dito ayan kasali siya so enter ko lang yan then you may be exempt you have taxes basahin nyo lang yan guys then ayan uh, click nyo lang then zero, zero rate then basahin nyo ulit yung reason kung ano bakit na exempt ka sa tax hindutin mo lang ulit yung box then motion picture and tv youtube and google play yan hindutin mo lang yan then yan 5% reduce rate So, yan. Babasahin mo naman yung uh, reason. Kaya, exemption ka. Yan. Pindutin mo lang yan. Yung other copyright, YouTube and Google Play. Ganon din po. Then, withholding rate. Yan. 5%. Then, yan lang. Reason na naman. Ay, basahin mo lang na maayos. Pindut lang. Next ka ulit. Then, ito na yung... Uh, form guys. So, makikita nyo dito. Gusto nyo i-view yung form na yan. Indutin mo lang yan. Kung okay na sa'yo yan. So, wala nang problema. So, ayan. I-next ka na lang. Pindutin mo yung box. Next. Then, yan yung certification guys. Yan yung nagkakasaad na under penalties of perjury. I declare that I have examine and the information of this form to the best of my knowledge and belief it is true and correct and complete I further certify under penalties of perjury kailangan tamang information yung nilagay nyo doon so sa baba nyan guys is yung your signature guys so ang nakalagay dyan full legal name dapat yung pinaka buong pangalan nyo po na ilagay dyan so dyan nga o oh, yan ilagay nyo lang yung pangalan ulit so yan na po yung pinaka signature nyo guys Then, uh, yan. Kung na-okay na yan, so has the individual of or entry identified in tax identity section perform any activity services for Google within the US. So, syempre, ang sagot natin dyan is no. Ayan. So, pagdating naman dyan guys sa uh, ano, are you providing tax for new existing payments that has not received or an existing payment profile that previously received payments. Siyempre, ang sagot mo dyan is I am providing tax for an existing payment profile that previously received payments. Siyempre, sumahod ka na, yun ang ilagay mo. Kung hindi ka naman sumahod, pipiliin mo yung isa. I am providing tax info for new existing that has not received payments. So, ganun lang guys. Ayan, no, then certify mo lang. Okay na. Oh, so, ayan. Napakadali lang guys. Ayan na guys. Approve na po siya guys. Ayan. Ayan na po yung uh, ano. Ayan, nakita nyo naman. So, yun yung the tax form without withholding tax rates and claim 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 tapos approve na so napakadali lang guys so kung hindi nyo po po alam paano gawin yung uh, pag fill up nyan so kailangan nyo muna magbasa or manood ng mga tutorial para hindi po kayo malito kasi pag yan mali mali po yung information ninyo guys syempre Ayan, mag-submit na naman kayo ng bagong form. Ayan, ganun lang guys, napakadali po. So, 
Ayan, salamat sa panonood guys. Ayan, salamat po sa uh, pag-antabay sa aking channel. Ayan, huwag kalimutan guys, subscribe po ang aking channel. At pakipindot po ang notification bell bago kayo mag-lib sa video na to. Ayan, maraming salamat and God bless you and salamat po sa lahat.